Hey guys, in this video we'll cover another three objectives for the MO100 exam and namely inspect document for issues, locate and remove hidden properties and personal information, locate and correct accessibility issues and locate and correct compatibility issues. Before we start, consider subscribing if you haven't done so already so that you don't miss out on any new training content and if you find this video useful, please smash the like button for the YouTube algorithm. That being said, let's begin. And all the relevant options for these objectives are available on the file tab in the info section. Here, inspect document. And we'll go through each of those options and we'll begin with inspect document. It checks the document for hidden properties or personal information. So let's click that. And now you have to select which sections. By default, it selects most of them. And to inspect the document, we click here, inspect. And in the exam, it would be specified which type of information you should remove. And it is common when you share your document online that sometimes you want your personal properties to be removed so in that case we would click here let's cancel that and go review the next option which is check accessibility it checks the document for content that people with disabilities might find difficult to read like objects or images so let's click that you can see that we have a rectangle here that has no text. We can also insert an image to test this accessibility feature. And also with this box, we can, for example, mark it as decorative or place this in line. And let's add an image and check it with our accessibility feature. So here I will insert some thumbnail, for example, this one. And you can see that the accessibility intelligence services recognized this picture and recommends us to verify the description. So you can see that an alternative text window is now opened. And here I can describe the image and simply close the window. So this is accessibility and the last one is check compatibility. So it checks for features not supported by ELE versions of Word. You can specify which versions to inspect and you can see that we have four places in this document where content controls will be converted to static content and something like that. So that is also useful when you want to share your document with broader audience and you can verify whether it will be seen by them as seen by you or whether some changes are necessary. So yeah guys, that is all for this video. I hope you find it useful. If so, smash the like button and we'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye.